Today's biology video is about the oceanic depths or this is the zones of the deep sea and I begin with the epipelag this is the first zone which is the smallest one and it reaches depth of 200 meters now I will place a few animals here to continue with the next one. There's a whale, a blue whale, that can be seen in the epipelang, a dolphin, right, a jellyfish, although jellyfish fishes may go in deeper zones. But for this exercise we are looking for or what we have in the game. I'm looking for another... Ah! There is the big eye tuna again in the epipelag and the sea, sea turtle. turtle. Now I, ha I have uh, five inhabitants of the epipelag. Then we are going deeper to the mesopelagic zone which may reach depths of one kilometer or a thousand meters now this second zone is a zone with a little or no light actually the light can penetrate maximum to the beginning of the body so although although this zone is missing a flight it have at least one percent of light here and let me place a few animals that inhabit this mesopelagic zone what is that a squid a squid <laughs> no squid a squid uh, the cat shark uh, crabs and uh, krill those are a basic examples of creatures that inhabit the mesopelagic zone and then I'm going deeper into the batipelag the batipelag can reach a depth of 4000 meters and in this zone there is no light anymore so here we can find some strange fishes like the viper fish octopus and sea stars sea stars those are example that inhabit the batipelag zone batipelagic zone and then i'm going into the abyssopelag or the abyss again a zone that is absent of any light any sort of light and it can reach a depth of six thousand meters now fishes in deep in this zone should have their own light source like the angler fish now that fish maybe a lot of people will not ever see in real except if they are very curious <laughs> But here is an example of the Abyssopelag and that black slower. Now this fish can swallow other fishes like snakes and sometimes if they are very hungry they can sprout out their bellies. <laughs> it is an interesting knowledge about this. And finally we are going to the Hadopelagic zone or the Hadopelag which uh, reach a depth of 11,000 meters and actually these zones are only ridges uh, between the tectonic plates. Yes, uh, so I will just place a few examples like sea cucumber, cucumber, sea cucumber and the liparit fish this is a type of liparit of course there are 
other leopard fishes that inhabit different zones. And these are the depth, oceanic depth zones. 